Bombay Beach may have one of the nicest sunsets along the Salton Sea, California's largest lake. Many of the town's residents moved here for the views and recreational lifestyle. One of the best beaches is right out there. But in 10 years, more than 30% of the water flowing into the Salton Sea will be diverted to urban areas, causing it to shrink. Experts say that will cause a whole host of serious problems, including polluted air. The future of coastal towns like Bombay Beach could be in jeopardy. If you reduce that amount of water because the sea is a closed system, is you're going to increase the temperature. You're also going to increase the salinity. The higher the salinity, the higher the temperature, it's going to cause more fish kills. So basically what you're going to have out there is a big septic tank. Dan Kane works for the Salton Sea Authority, a public agency developing a comprehensive plan for the Salton Sea's problems. Our plan addresses all of the issues that the public is concerned about. You know, the public is concerned about recreation, fishing, water skiing, air quality, wildlife. His group's proposal is one of eight being considered by California to save the Salton Sea. The state's priority is to preserve the lake as a habitat for migratory birds and maintain air and water quality. State agencies held an outreach meeting today in Bombay Beach to educate residents about some of the proposals. Some residents believe the plans encourage people to move rather than stay. It seems like they're trying to push everybody out. They're pushing people out by um, not allowing access to the sea. People aren't uh, um, able to fish. Officials admit consensus will be hard to reach with so many issues that need to be addressed. But people are willing to bend a little and we're willing to bend a little too. We can reach some sort of a, a, a happy medium, something that maybe they're not totally happy with, but something that they can support. The residents of Bombay Beach will now have to consider just what they are willing to give up. David Chong, Annenberg TV News.